Mecklenburg County no longer has bragging rights as the largest county in the state. New census numbers show Wake County took the coveted spot with 25% population growth over the last decade, but another county not many were expecting came in third place. Fox 46 chief political correspondent Emma Withrow joins us with details on a huge spike of growth in Cabarrus County. Yeah, Emma, you went down to Concord today, a downtown area. Is growth obvious there? It really is, Brian. There was a ton of construction in downtown Concord, and the business owners I spoke with were a mix of people who've either owned their shop there for 37 years or opened it up in the last six months. One bookstore owner said he decided to open up his bookshop there within the last six months strictly because of the massive amount of growth that, the, that Cabarrus County has seen. David Kern worked in publishing before deciding to open up his own bookstore in downtown Concord. Just since we opened the store, we've seen three or four different condo units start to be built and deconstruction that's going to lead to construction and new businesses coming in. He's not afraid of competing with giants like Amazon because his shop gives folks more than just a book with two day shipping. Here in the store I see a lot of people from who come talk to me from not just different walks of life but different religions and in a bookstore it's kind of like being a bartender. You end up chatting to people, chatting with people sometimes for a long time. Cabarrus County has become much more diverse after growing 27 percent in the last 10 years. The future growth that we're anticipating made it I feel like it was okay to take that calculated risk. All the condos and apartments they're putting up, all the investment that they're putting into getting new businesses. Kern feels Cabarrus County has become a hot spot because of its location outside of Charlotte. They're seeing property taxes are lower, the housing market's a little cheaper for now. Um, and I do think that Concord itself and, and the county has kind of a, even as it's growing, kind of a small town feel. And Kern says since he opened his bookstore, business has been booming. It's located right next door to a little coffee shop down there in downtown Concord. So it's a great spot for foot traffic as people are walking down and shopping. If I had more time, I probably would have grabbed a cup of coffee and read a book there. But we had to have a show tonight. Guys? Certainly a growing community, Emma. And to break down this data even further, 900,000 people moved to the Tar Heel State over the last 10 years. Out of the state's 100 counties, over half had more residents leave than move with Anson County, which is southeast of Charlotte, actually losing 18% of its population. Experts believe some of those people moved to the metro areas of Charlotte or Raleigh, together making up 39% of the whole state's population. Yeah.